America has a new hero, Captain Pete Maverick Mitchell, one who is not afraid to take on China. When the first trailer for Top Gun Maverick was released, the fans noticed a key detail. The flag of Taiwan on Tom Cruise's jacket was replaced by another symbol. In the original Top Gun movie that released in 1986, Tom Cruise wears a jacket as a tribute to his late father. The flags are a reference to his father's service on the USS Galveston CLG-3 cruiser in the Pacific Ocean. The back of the jacket is emblazoned with patches, including one joint operation with Taiwan. So when the trailer for the sequel was released in 2019, Fans noticed that the Taiwan flag was replaced. In the trailer, Tom Cruise's jacket had made up emblems that matched the color schemes of the original. Top Gun Maverick was originally slated for release in July 2019, but the premiere was pushed back until this year due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Special. Fellas, this here's Bagman. Hangman. Oh, whatever. What the hell kind of mission is this? Maverick Mitchell. Let me be perfectly blunt. You are not my first choice. You are here at the request of Admiral Kazansky, aka Iceman. He seems to think that you have something left to offer the Navy. What that is, I can't imagine. With all due respect, sir, I'm not a teacher. But despite the trailer censoring the symbols, it looks like Captain Pete Maverick Mitchell finally understood the assignment in 2022. The movie had Tom Cruise sporting the same jacket, this time with the flag of Taiwan back on it. And this shows a crucial change in Hollywood's stance. It looks like they are no longer hell-bent on winning the Chinese market. Use of the Taiwanese flag has the potential to anger Xi Jinping. But the newly released movie has gone ahead with it anyway. While Taiwanese fans are heartened to see their flag restored on the jacket, Chinese fans are angry. China is the world's largest box office. It sold nearly $7.3 billion in ticket sales last year. But access to this lucrative market is difficult. The government only permits 34 foreign films to screen in Chinese theatres per year. And pleasing Beijing's film censors is very hard. They don't air any movie or scene that does not align with China's own politics. Over the years, Hollywood has tried very hard to not anger China. They have removed scenes and played by Xi Jinping's rules. But in the last few years, there has been a growing rift between Beijing and Hollywood. Top Gun Maverick is yet to release in mainland China, and by the looks of it, it may not get a release date.